official announcement. How are we all doing out there? Yeah! You can take some of the treble off there, bring it down loud. Thank you so much. All right, here we are in Clarksdale, Mississippi. Home of the Delta Blues, John Lee Hooker, Ike Turner, Sam Cook. The list goes on. What a, what a great place for us to have uh, another Cigar Box Guitar Festival. Uh, my name is Steve Harvey. I'm with the American Cigar Box Guitar Association. I'd also like to thank other uh, board of directors of the Cigar Box Guitar Association. Uh, Matt Ritchie. And I also want to thank Ed Kirk. Larry Feldman, and um, here we are, we've got a great night tonight with uh, Watermelon Slim and um, other musicians are going to be coming up and uh, this is kind of our big party before tomorrow. In case you don't know what's going on tomorrow, we've, um, we now uh, have a display at the Delta Blues Museum um, about cigar box guitars and um, we're, we're doing a, a concert tomorrow raising money for the Delta Blues Museum for free tomorrow. Uh, right out there, it starts at 10 o'clock. There's going to be builders. There's builders from all over that have uh, submitted their guitars. It's going to be really exciting, and that goes on from 10 till 5. And then tomorrow night at the New Roxy, we've got uh, Super Chicken, Ben Prestige, Johnny Lobo, uh, along with myself and Matt, Rebecca. We've got a big, big, uh, big lineup tomorrow. Without further ado, I want to introduce uh, uh, a, a great blues man who's stories, um, his knowledge of, of the, the instrument, his, his field, uh, not only as, as of, of guitars, but as of uh, harmonica and storyteller and uh, a great knowledgeable man and uh, well, a person I respect a lot. And um, he actually is living now here in Clarksdale. Without further ado, I'd like to bring to the stage right now, Mr. Watermelon Slim. Now this is not the first time I've hung out with Mr. Steve Arby. I was on a uh, blues cruise once upon a time. And, uh, and I think he was actually the first blues cruise that I went on. And Steve and I were uh, uh, able to uh, show some people how to go, how to play the bass on the guitar a little bit. He's very good at that. and. Uh, when he asked me, well, do I want to do something with uh, diddly bows? I said, sure, I'll do that. I've got some diddly bows. And I'm going to start out here tonight just fiddling around with these diddly bows. Eventually, we're going to get some very fine musicians, some of whom I played with, some of whom I haven't yet played with. And uh, we're going to make this all happen in here. Thank you very much for coming to be a cigar box festival here and it's going to be a, just a cool cool thing let's hand up these things first just a little bit what we got right here is the one that's working not as well as the rest of them this neon playing hop with it this is a Four string diddly bow from Washington Robbie Phillips back in uh, Cambridge, Massachusetts. I have two of these. He calls them the pine wood. Now, when he makes resonator guitars, what he calls them is the, wait for it, Yo Bro. And he's made over 300 of them. These are two of the only ones, the one that I have back home, this one here, that are west of the Mississippi River. If I think this is gonna, gonna moderate itself after all this neon, well, maybe it will, maybe it won't. Got another one here. like Diddley Bowers. This was actually the first one to replace the first Yakandanda Australia Diddley Bow that was stolen and run over in a car chase. And I've got the other one that replaced that, the new Yakandanda from Victoria State Diddley Bow. But 
We love these. This is, this is a touchstone for all of us. I may plug this one in after a while. But first of all, I'm going to go ahead and start with my R Not Cookie Can guitar from Yakindanda, Australia, one of the towns in the great Australian gold rush. And now it's a nice little town, uh, a lot of art going on, a lot of good food in it. And it was my favorite gig several years ago when I come to Australia, playing with Fiona Boys. You can see it is an R not cookie can that we've uh, that Mr. Shane Soul of Yakindanda has turned into this magnificent Diddly Bow guitar. I love this stuff. Keep your mouth in the burning See what the 